football team is in the dark once again. A court just ordered the school to turn off the lights for their homecoming game. Andrea Nakano joins us now from Novato. She has the play-by-play. -play. Andrea? After a four-year legal battle, the lights finally came on on the football field here at San Marin High. Now a last-minute court injunction puts tomorrow's homecoming game in the dark. What's the use of lights if you can never turn them on? Frustrated parents, students, and coaches tonight as a Marin judge issued a temporary restraining order pulling the plug on the field lights at San Marin High. I'm down. I'm a little bit down. But it's actually kind of it's pushing me even more. It's pushing all of us. Now we really... Now it's on. Last week, the Novato Unified School District voted unanimously to turn on the lights for the first time after filing a revised environmental impact report. A judge, though, ruled the district acted prematurely. The court claims it needs time to see if the report complies with the California Environmental Quality Act. Plus, the Save San Marin Coalition says it hasn't had a chance to weigh in on the report. We would like to settle this and get this in the past, okay? But we want to do it in a way that all of us in the community, including the students, can feel proud that as a civics lesson, it's been done right. Now with this recent legal setback, homecoming has been rescheduled. The parade went on as planned, but instead of playing under the Friday night lights, kickoff for the game will be on Saturday afternoon. It's disappointing, but as a team, we know that it's just playing football, enjoy playing football. Playing under the lights will play anywhere, anytime. Just the ability to play under the lights that one time, that's, that's, that's good with me. While this year's senior class may not be able to play under the lights again this season, coaches have hope next year will be different. This is going to happen. It's just a matter of time. The school district says it's looking forward to its day in court and feels that the report is fully compliant. The next court date is set for November 14th. Andrea Nakano on the Night Beat.